Hi, everybody. Uh, thank you for tuning in. My name is Samantha Hermosillo. I am a regional manager for motor staffing. And I wanted to check in and remind everybody that even though the holidays are here, this is not the time to slow down your job search. In fact, this is a great time to get your resume out to hiring managers. And if you don't have your resume ready, this is the time to set yourself up for your job search going into 2021. I can tell the holidays look different for each company, but the one thing that is consistent is companies are looking for new team members to join their growing teams in the new year. We are constantly reviewing resumes and talking with our clients on a daily basis. So what does that mean for you? Well, for you, if you don't already have your job search checklist completed, now's the perfect time to get that checklist going. Uh, the most important items on your checklist are gonna be updating your resume. Make sure your dates, job descriptions, and all of your contact information are accurate. Use a template if you have to, but remember, resumes are not meant to be cute. They are meant to be professional. So no pictures, no colorful creative fonts. Make sure your email address is professional. Your resume is your first impression of you, okay? And this is what clients are looking at. This is what we look at. Um, all of the coloring, all of that distracts from the data, the information that's enlisted on your resume. Update your cover letter. Not all clients are gonna want, not all companies are gonna want a cover letter but you definitely want to have one available and ready to go. Use the same formatting that you use in your resume. Um, this, is, this is important because of consistency. You don't want it to be all over the place. Um, call your references. These are the people that are going to speak for you professionally. You want to call them, let them know that they're going to be getting calls from companies that you're interviewing with and make sure you have their correct phone numbers and email addresses. You should have a minimum of two to three professional references on standby, okay? You can also create a reference sheet. This reference sheet should follow the same formatting as your resume and your cover letter. Have one to two outfits ready to interview. You want to dress for the job you're interviewing for. Business casual is probably going to be your best bet for your baseline, okay? For all non-industrial positions, business casual um, being your baseline you should be prepared with a blazer or suit jacket, depending on the position. For industrial positions, this can be on the position, but your baseline should be a clean, darker shaded pair of pants, a polo, or a button-up colored shirts. Some industrial clients will require you to interview with steel-toed shoes um, in case you are doing a facility tour. Just make sure you ask this question when you're setting up for your actual interview. If you're nervous about your interview, practice with a friend talk to yourself in a mirror. Sounds funny, right? Talking to yourself in front of a mirror, but this lets you see what your prospective employer sees and it helps you get comfortable, confidently talking about you and your experiences. Okay, now that you've worked through these items on your checklist, it's time to get out there. Start registering with staffing agencies and checking their website job boards for open positions. You also wanna check other various job boards, for example, LinkedIn, Indeed, ZipRecruiter, Facebook, and several others. Talk to your friends and family and ask if they know of companies that are hiring. Now is the time to network, not a time to slow down. Okay, well, we wish you all the luck in your job search going into 2021. Merry Christmas and happy holidays.